Hello and welcome. This is Darius Barasande, host of the U.S. Revolution. And if you're about to watch this amazing session that we did, then you're part of a group of humans on this planet who are ascending and moving into a higher frequency. You're not here by accident, and I'd like to offer you a special gift that will help you to adjust to some of these frequencies, plug in even deeper, and it's an energy activation MP3 that will double the power of your energy field in less than 57 seconds. It's absolutely free, and it's the first link in the description down below, but it's also going to let you get to hear calls like this one live and get daily help from healers, teachers, and masters all over the world. It's absolutely free and it's part of what we're doing every day at UAuth Revolution. So if you feel called in your heart, you can click the link down below and the special session that you wanted to watch and experience will start right now. Let's start a little bit um, about your story. How did you begin to actually come across what seems to be a system and how did you become interested in this? Well, as you said earlier, uh, I went through massive spiritual growth periods from quite a young age. In fact, when I was eight years old, I was even questioning our very existence. When I was 10 years old, I was having premonitions. Um, I then went through a phase with no help, no assistance, came across my first spiritual mentor, then my second spiritual mentor, my third spiritual mentor. Incredible people. I have been blessed to be in the company of some wonderful, magnificent people. But my personal life was going through some massive ups and downs. I mean, huge, huge ups and downs. And it was actually my daughter who actually uh, was fully aware of all my spiritual growth, and she's a very enlightened indigo child herself and uh, she said dad she said um, I heard about this guy in England he analyzes people's names she hmm. said I, I didn't really look into it but why don't you check it out because maybe that might be something related well of course as you know Darius there are no accidents everything on planet earth happens for a reason and right. so this was my little intro so I checked in with this guy and um, he did a name analysis for me and I was also blown away with the accuracy. I've always been a business person, and I've been in various different areas, and um, you know, big companies with lots of employees or smaller businesses and so forth. Mm -hmm. And I've actually been through three bankruptcies, three bankruptcies. Mm -hmm. And every time, people around me have said, I don't understand. Why? What's going on? You're doing the same business, the same location, same employees. You're taking care of customers, taking care of clients. What's going on? I said, I don't know either. It's just like there was this dark cloud suddenly hanging over me. And I can remember back in the late 1980s when I was in England, and uh, everybody went through this crash. Business for everybody dropped. Uh, lots of companies in the same line of business as me were laying off employees. I was flying high. I was getting all the business. And I thought, I know I'm pretty good at my job, but I'm not that good. I'm not that good. Of course, back then, I didn't know anything about the name system. So it turns out this guy in England, who was called Lawrence Paig, unfortunately, he actually passed away a few years ago. Um, but he actually analyzed all of my names. And he was pinpointing all this stuff. Um, it's a two-part system. The first part is about your personalities, the good, the bad, and the ugly. But the second part, which really gets people excited, is the events chart. And when he went through my events chart, he pinned all of my downfalls right down to the year. And when I was riding high and everybody else was suffering the recession, I was in these okay. powerful letters that gave me an invisible helping hand. So, yeah, I got really, really interested. Um, so I signed up with this guy, I uh, learned the system, and then I um, picked up some more information on my own, and it just went on from there. And, um, well, this is now what I do. This is my full-time occupation. I help mm. people understand more about themselves from their names. And you talk about codes and the Akashic Records. Well, the vibration created by letters of the alphabet it's another fundamental principle of the universe. And we have got the code. We've got the key to unlock the code. So, um, yeah, I'm, I'm obviously very, very excited. And uh, it just keeps rolling on for me year after year. It just gets better and better and better. And, and the feedback that I get from clients is just incredible. I think I've got over 100 
reviews now. It, it's it's just rolling beautifully, and I'm helping so many people understand why they get these dips. And when you understand these dips, you can take control. It, it's quite powerful, quite powerful indeed. Let's talk about um, why, because um, how can a name energetically impact someone's reality? Well, this is a two-part system, so if I can just touch on that. The first part talks about your characters, your personality, virtues, vices, and areas of both mental and physical health. The second part is how individual letters from each of your names rotate in a specific sequence every year, and we can create a lifelong chart. So it's the actual vibration of letters of the alphabet, which actually come from ancient, ancient symbols. And this vibration reflects upon the human body. Now, this name system that we have here, this is not for your business. This is not for cats and dogs, the name of your boat. This is how the, the vibration from letters of the alphabet, ancient symbols, reflect upon the human body. And it's the combination of all of your names, and it's the combination of all the letters in your events chart that, that influence what's going to happen during your life, but more important, it also shows the way that you're going to deal with it. So, um, powerful, powerful stuff, yeah. History-wise, we were talking privately, you mentioned uh, this having different roots in the Vedic systems and some other cultures. Talk a little bit about that, because you you uncovered this. Who uncovered it in the beginning? I mean, where did it come from? Uh, what are some of the cultures maybe oh. that used it or were yeah. impacted by it? Mm -hmm. Oh, I'd love to share this information because I think it's very important that people do understand that this is not a hokey-pokey theory. This is not just something that I came up with. No, far from it. All that I've done is I've taken all the existing information that was available, and in mm -hmm. the process I did actually crack a little numerical code. I, I actually think it was left there purposely for me to discover. Um, so I have been able to take the system up just a little notch, but the basic system, no, it, it, it goes way back. Uh, if I just um, go a little bit in reverse order, I mentioned the guy called Lawrence Pague in England. Okay. He uh, was actually a very successful name analyst using this name system. And um, he's probably best known for changing the name of an aspiring model called Laura Hollins. As you know, in the model industry, acting and pop singers and stars, of course, they're very often changing their names as the done thing. Anyway, for this girl, Laura Hollins, he changed her name to Agnes Dean. Well, she was already with a top model agency in London, Models One. And she was just not getting any business. The girl was cute, beautiful, you know, but she just wasn't getting the bookings. She changed her name to Agnes Dean, and within one year, I mean, you can check this stuff up on the internet, within one year she was voted Model of the Year in 2007. She became the face of Armani and the face of Burberry, and nothing changed except for her name. She had the same hairstyle, the same agent, the same makeup, Nothing changed apart from her names, and her life just turned around within the space of a year. Um, that's the more recent stuff. Lawrence Pague actually got his information, and I also got my information, from a book that was written in 1929 by two sisters from the Chicago area, Violita Park Boyle and her sister Elvrita. And on subsequent research, I discovered that these two sisters literally spent their entire lives on the study of names and different name systems. And they came across this system that we have here now today, and they actually wrote a book called The Fundamental Principles of the Yi King Tao, the Kabbalahs of Egypt, and the Hebrews. And where did they get the information from? Well, um, it was actually documented in China in its splendid entirety, and it was actually known as the way of life. This goes back a couple of thousand years. Uh, much more complicated versions can also be found of this exact system in the Indian Vedas and the Hebrew okay. Kabbalists. Hmm. Then going further back again, which is kind of like the root of 
as far back as we know where it actually came from. There was a hieratic papyrus that was discovered in Egypt. This was about 150 years ago. And the actual papyrus is actually stored and preserved in the Louvre Library in, in Paris. Okay. And just over 100 years ago, a translation was actually made. And uh, it's what is actually called the Book of the Master of the Secret House. So the history goes back several thousand years for this exact system that we're talking about now. And I haven't changed anything on the system apart from just a couple of minor little discoveries which have allowed me to tweak it and make it a bit easier to, to understand, ultimately. So yeah, I mean, steeped, steeped with history. Hello and welcome, this is Darius Barzani, host of the Wealth Revolution, and if you enjoyed that snippet of one of our interviews, I'd invite you to just scroll down for one second and click the link down below. You're going to get access not only to a free gift that's going to double the power of your energy field in just 57 seconds, you're also going to get to be a part of the U.S. Revolution and listen to interviews just like the ones you heard that are happening live right now daily where I interview some of the top healers, teachers, and masters in the field of energy transformation, energy healing, consciousness, ascension, and more. Plus, you're gonna to get to be on live calls where you'll get your questions answered, you'll get to submit them via webcast, you'll even get to be one-on-one -on -one live on the phone and get energy healing help daily. It's all part of what we've been doing. So get up to date, click the link, join, and be a part of it. And if you enjoyed this video or you like to see more of it, Click the like button or subscribe. I always upload new content and I give weekly energy updates. So please let us know how we can serve you. And thanks for watching and being in my life. Much love.